Hello everybody, it's me, Kilma. Welcome back to Product Ozone 2 Kappa Mode. Last episode we went ahead and uh, killed the end dragon pretty quickly. And I also went and got a ton of draconium dust between episodes and turned some of it into ingots. Now I thought I was going to be able to do something cool with it, but I can't yet. Because if we look at it, type in draconium or this draconic. Uh, I need to make the energy infuser to be able to make charged draconium blocks. So that way I can do the ritual to resummon the end dragon. Well, that's fine. I mean, particle generator, yeah, gemma table, draconium ingots. But it's this thing, draconic cores that need glowing mang alloy, which requires mang alloy and zephyrian ethereum. And mang alloy is just steel and a rich slag, so it's pretty easy to make. But I don't really have a good way of harvesting a zephyrium ethereum. I mean, I have the fluid cows for it, but I don't want to go over there, bucket it up, put it in a tank and everything. So, today we're going to be making a rancher. This will do all that for me. I already have most of the parts for this. All I need now is a fluid conduit, which requires a conduit binder. The binder is just dust, salt, and clay. And in order to actually make salt, I'm going to need water and my cooking uh, utensils that I believe I put in the food chest. I did indeed. Go like that. And boom, we got two things of salt. That should actually be all that I'm going to need for this, because let's see, that makes six. Yeah, that should be it. Okay, so I'm gonna go make the conduit, the flu conduit that is, and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back with the fluid conduits. It made 16 of them, so I guess that's good if I ever need to make uh, 16 ranchers, that is. And I also need two things of shears. Thankfully I had just enough iron in that chest right there. Didn't have to run down and get more. Two shears. And there we go. Rancher. Okay, so next off I need a place uh, to put the cow. That I want to harvest from. Uh, hmm. I could put them down here, maybe? Huh. And I'll talk about what's over there in a bit. Uh, I guess just put them right here in this corner. That'll work. Okay. So I now need to get some cobblestone uh, walls to uh, keep him from uh, running away. Go over here. I'm just gonna make it a really small area. Animal cruelty laws and all. I know. And let's see. Put down the rancher there. Break that block. Hopefully that's somewhere I can get to uh, easily. And yeah. And here is a Zephyrium Ethereum cow, I'm pretty sure. And it is. Let's see, did I get another one over here while I was waiting? Let's see. Are you Zephyrium Ethereum? No, you're Nickel. What about you? No, you're Ethanol. How about down here? Any of you Zephyrium Ethereum? Does not look like it. So I'm not going to bother. Okay, well, I'm going to go power this up, put a drum at the rear end of it, and I'll be back once I've done that. And there we go. We got our first thing of Zephyrium Ethereum. For some reason, whenever this thing, uh, quote-unquote, milks the cows, it resets the tick to be very short. Because normally it's like 3,000 per thing, but as you see here, it goes to 400, like if it was a regular cow. So that's actually pretty nice. Uh, I hooked up the power source to underneath my mom farm. So this should still be powering everything else, including the rancher. Yep. So yeah, 
again, this thing has come in uh, real handy. And yeah, I guess now it's time to explain what that thing is underneath my base. Well, you all know that I made this cobble gen, and it's going alright. I mean, I have one septuple, but it is very, very slow. So I was bored, and I made uh, this monstrosity. Uh, I don't have a node here, because for some reason this block does not want to harvest. So, yeah. I literally just finished making this, and it's already got four quintuple. So, it is making cobblestone very fast. And, yeah. That will help me get on to with uh, getting bedrockium and whatnot. And, let's see. Is there anything I can work on today? No, it doesn't look like it, so I think what we'll do is we'll just go have some fun in the nether, go spawn a few withers, and get their uh, nether stars. Let's see, I need three, six, nine, twelve, then I need a few more so I can make, that way I can make uh, wither seeds later on. But yeah, let's go to the nether and uh, kill a wither. Okay, it's so much nicer that I can fly now. I mean, it just helps and saves so much time. Hmm. Okay. Kill everything over here. Because if I don't, it will kill me. Where's that gas at? Gas, where are you? I hear you, but I don't see you. I was over there. Why can I hear you so well? Oh, well, now you're dead. Let's just go ahead and go one, two, three. And dead. Oh god, I hated that I can spawn blazes. Dead. And then, uh, two more? Yeah, two more. Stop spawning blazes. And then one more. Oh, whoop. got a little bit of lag on that one. Okay. And, let's see, we got seven nether stars out of that. I see those being pretty good. A few infinity card boosters. It's also uh, alright. Eh, Zavisio, rare shaders, four major hearts. And okay, I guess that's it for this video. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.